Good morning, good morning congregation and thank you once again for this opportunity for me to share the word of God with you. Um, yeah, a long time ago and this is nearly the end and uh, we can look forward to see one another soon and giving hugs, giving no kisses, but we can uh, uh, even be close to one another and look into one another's eyes. Uh, this morning I want to share a, a strange but a nice uh, a piece of scripture from you, uh, from the Word of God. And uh, I quickly want to, sh to, to, to share a story. When I was cycling and uh, every time I go down to, to Cape Town with the Cape Argus and you enroll, and then you have to go and pick up your number for your, for to be part of this uh, uh, event. And when you pick up your number, you get a, a goodie bag. Now in this goodie bag, there was will be some some things that will help you on the road, like a, 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 a bar, a chocolate bar, or something that a energy bar that gives you. Uh, strengths along the road and uh, and there's some small stuff like uh, uh, energy the power rate and stuff in there now today I found a goodie bag in one of the scriptures in God's Word and I'm so excited about this uh, uh, goodie bag and I want to share it with you and this I found in in Daniel 2 and I read from verse 20 Blessed be the name of God forever and ever. For wisdom and might are His, and He changes the time and the season. He removes kings and raises up kings. He gives wisdom to the wise and knowledge to those who have understanding. He reveals deep and secret things. He knows what it is in the darkness and light dwells within him and uh, out of this I will start from the bottom of the scripture and uh, uh, Daniel uh, speak out of a time when the when when there was sorrow when there was uh, hardship in the in, the, in the, the, the the nation of Israel and uh, it was taking me back to the same circumstances that we are founded uh, as in uh, during this COVID time. Uh, we we are in hardship, paying our bills, and uh, we find us in a place where we we want to cry out to God for help. And. Uh, I found this goodie bag and I will start with the from the bottom of this goodie bag and first of all it says and light dwells within him and the darkness that you face the 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 the, the, the way forward that you cannot see the the circumstances that blind you that you cannot see uh, God's real uh, 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 hand and power in your life this goodie bag says there is light and the light dwells within him it's there already it's there you have light in this goodie bag the second one he knows what lies in the darkness oh man how can you how can you be troubled how can you 
your heart be uh, uh, troublesome if God knows what lies in the darkness dark you don't have to fear for the darkness you don't need to fear for the darkness and 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 the third one that goes that he reveals deep and hidden things oh yes during this time God actually wants us to bring us down on our knees so that he can talk to us in times of tribulation and 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 and, uh, and trials this is the time that God wants to tell us my son this is what I want to give you this is what I want to uh, reveal to you open your heart open your mind open your the eyes of your heart so that you can see what God wants to reveal to you open your ears so that that deep hidden things God can reveal to you when you are down on your knees when you are uh, on the ground you don't know where to there is in the deep down of your circumstances that is where God wants to touch you and bring you out of fall he gives wisdom to the wise and knowledge to the discourage the sun people is there something that you don't know is there something that you that that, that uh, uh, you are uh, fearful of uh, uh, is there uh, uh, you don't know the way forward you don't know about tomorrow you don't know about next month where does the rent comes from this is what God do. This is what God do. He give you knowledge. He will give you a way out. He will give you knowledge how to, 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 to go. He give you wisdom. How to deal with this situation. I trust in Him. Five. He set up kings and He dispose them as well. He set up kings and He take them down as well. So, if this thing, the circumstances that lord over you as a king, as a giant, maybe, because kings are big men, they are powerful. If it's lording over you, God is the one that can remove them. God is the only one that can dispose it because he raised them up to that level. What king is there in your mind, your work situation? This time around, you cannot go for and ask for for a, a, a increase. <laughs> you can go, don't go, cannot go and ask for a, 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 a promotion. That king of you are standing there. God can remove it. God can deal with them. Six. He changes time and seasons. Oh man. This time that we are in, it will change. The season that you are in, it will change. God can change it because He changes times and seasons. It is in His hand, it's in His power. Go and, 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 and just let this time where you are in know, know, know it that it will pass. Know that this season also will pass into a next season. Uh, um, seven, wisdom and power are his. Because of that, the wisdom that you need, the power that you need, you feel like you are so small around this kings around the situation around the circumstances that we are in we are so small oh yes the church there's no church the church's doors are closed they seems like it's so small the whole church fit into a cell phone that's fine that's where god's power and wisdom lies in he is in control not us let us just let him be and let him uh, do it. And then the last part, actually in the beginning, on top of air, on, in this goodie bag, they say, praise be to the name of God 
forever and ever. That's all that we have to do. We have to acknowledge Him as God over us. We have to acknowledge Him that He is the Lord. He is in control. We have to acknowledge Him and say, Lord, I need you. The moment we say that, the moment we come to Him, He will give you the light in the darkness. He will give you knowledge. He will reveal hidden things to you. The moment you say, Lord, yes, you help me to get rid of this king in my life, dispose him, then he will do it. Because I cannot do it. In my own strength, I'm not able to do it. And then, then I, 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 I end off with this, this powerful scripture in, in uh, Proverbs 3, verse 5 and 6. It says, trust the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge Him and He shall direct your paths. Do you need Him? Yes. Do you want Him? Yes. Are you ready for God to change your season? Are you ready for God to give you wisdom? Are you ready to, for God to, 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 to just reveal mysteries to you? Go down to Him. Say to Him, I praise you in your time of worship. When your praises goes up, when praises goes up, His glory will come down. Glorify Him with everything. The Word of God is so clear. Whatever you do, do it for His glory, for His kingdom's sake. Let's pray together. Lord, thank You that we are not abandoned. Lord, thank You that we are not alone thank you that you didn't give us a heart of fear a fearful mind no you are there for us it's because you care that we can face tomorrow because you your grace and your mercy that we can go along and face the devil face our circumstances face this 2020, this year brought a lot of changes. This year brought a lot of fear. This uh, 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 year brought a lot of uncertainty. But one thing we know, as we praise you, and as we trust you, and as we acknowledge our, our, our dependency upon you, may you be glorified. May you be praised. May your name be, be lifted up forever and ever because you are the one that will change the season. You are the one that will change this time. Thank you. Be with everyone, wherever they are. Anyone that is uh, uh, listening to this word, bless them, Lord, and give them your peace, your peace that surpasses all understanding so that they can put their trust in you. Amen. Thank you very much. And yes, church, we are looking forward. And as a deer panted for water, we are panting and waiting to see you, to be you, so that he can quench our thirst. Amen.